How's it going, everyone? Um, this is my first YouTube video, actually, and um, this is what it's about. I have a 2012 Volkswagen Golf TDI, and it's a very, very fast car. Um, yeah, what I'm, what I'm going to be doing today is I actually got a Rawtech exhaust system that was almost $900, and I'm going to be taking it to a shop, getting it put in, getting everything retuned, and I'm also going to go over my car a little bit, and I'm going to take you guys on a journey of how I'm going to upgrade everything. Um, the body of it is kind of stock right now. Okay, so here's the car. It's kind of nice on the inside. Got a little manual thing. I work at Domino's. It's kind of dirty right now. Um, you can see it has red lining. I painted all of this, all the interior and stuff. Got a little thing right here. But yeah, this is a 2012 Volkswagen Golf TDI. I actually just fixed the um, coolant reservoir because that was split and it was leaking. So I just fixed that, not leaking anymore, but it does build up pressure pretty bad because it's the, um, oh, that wasn't close all the way. Whoever did that, dumbass, probably me. Um, okay, yeah, 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 let's go over what I got really quick. Okay. So aftermarket injections, I got a Garrett CR 170 turbo. It's sitting right there. You can kind of see it. Aftermarket, got some lights going on in the front. It's kind of all minimal right now. I am not working on the body until the inside of the car is done. Um, right now I'm pushing about 340 pounds of horse, or pounds. Right now I'm pushing 340 horsepower and 460 pounds of torque on this car. The Rawtech exhaust is going to add at least another 70 horsepower or so. I'd say I'm mostly going for power right now on a sleeper. I have a stock air intake. I don't have an intercooler yet and stuff, but I'm going to get that. But um, here's the exhaust right here. This is crazy big. I'll show you how fat the pipes are. Look at how big these boys are. Look at that. Here's my hand. Look at that. These are three inch pipes. This came from Raw Tech. This is a audi volkswagen porsche exhaust system and it's completely getting rid of the cats it's getting rid of the egr and it's gonna sound amazing so um right now on the tdi i actually have a gti exhaust going from the normal exhaust conversion it's kind of pointless but it does give it better airflow i'd say um here let's do this <laughs> All right, so if you heard that, you can hear that my RPMs, if I hold them, they only stay at 2.5 thousand RPMs and they don't fluctuate past that. The reason is, is because the EGR is holding the pressure in the car. It's a pressurized vehicle. It's actually not gas. This is a diesel, so everything's held under pressure when it's running. So the turbo and all the air, it's literally pushing the car. That's how it works. But I have a check engine light on because I have, um, what are they called? Uh, they're called glow plugs my glow plugs need to be currently replaced and that will be done too at the shop there's a lot of things that are going to be done with this car hopefully you guys will like to stay updated and up to tune with my build this is my beautiful build my volkswagen i had a shitty v6 mustang before but we're going to build this it's got some side swipe damage but we're going to get rid of that too gonna fix this thing up it's gonna be looking good we're gonna lower it we're gonna get some bc coils we're gonna get some rims it's gonna be looking good so hopefully you guys enjoy this video okay so i forgot to mention this um i took my car to the shop didn't really record much but i actually got this clip so yeah 